we report from Essex on the anglers banned from fishing because of a seal that's stuck in their lake. Now, this is the seal that has been trapped in a lake in Essex for the past month, despite repeated attempts to rescue it. Rochford Reservoir is a lake for anglers, which probably explains why the seal is in no hurry to leave. A ban on fishing in the lake has been put in place to protect the seal, but the seal is ignoring the ban completely and eating its way through the fish stocks, much to the despair of local anglers. No wonder it's looking so relaxed. Helena Wilkinson reports. Basking in the winter sunshine with not a care in the world. This young seal may appear carefree and cute, but it's been causing havoc in this quiet fishing lake in Essex. It's taken up residence at the Rochford Reservoir for nearly a month. And in that time, it's eaten its way through 3,000 pounds worth of fish. The owner of the fisheries, Nick North, has had to turn away regular users due to plummeting fish stocks. Devastated, I think. It'd be an understatement of what's happened. After all these years building it up and then within a month to see it come crashing down. It's thought the seal made its way upstream along a nearby river in December. Since then, it's put on a good amount of weight thanks to the abundance of fish on offer. It has little incentive to leave. So far, two attempts have been made to try to get the seal out safely, but it's managed to evade capture. Seals can live healthily in fresh water, but it's not ideal. Rescuers are going to make another attempt next week to try to get the seal out and back into its natural habitat. Catching this one is a completely different kettle of fish. When um, the net has closed in, he's just either swum underneath it or hopped over the top. Um, so we do need to change tack a bit. There was some concern about injuries to the seal on its tail and eye, but experts say they don't appear to be causing it any discomfort. <laughs> For now, until the next rescue attempt, the seal remains in this reservoir, to the delight of locals enjoying this rare and very well-fed guest. Helena Wilkinson, BBC News, Rochford in Essex. Sally is here. Uh, yeah. Sally, let's just remind our viewers, we, we saw that hungry seal in oh, Essex, didn't we? Oh, all just came at once. <laughs> He's having a... He, well, saying, he or she is having yeah. a jolly good time, but he or she has not yet been maimed. Well, we should name him, well, I then. Think you, you, I think you'd be good at this kind of okay. thing. So, well, ideas. I can think of one really obvious <laughs> one. I'm not going to point it out to you. We can't quite... That's like a baby. You what? can't give him, like an old-fashioned name, like, you can't really have Roger the baby anymore. You can't really have Roger the seal or Geoffrey the seal. I don't think that really well, works. You could... We could be selfish about it. We could go for Lucrezia. I was thinking more Sally the seal, oh, if it's I a girl, we right? Gonna... <laughs> no one can spell Lucrezia, so yes, everyone can spell Sally. I hope everyone can spell Sally. I'm really sorry if you can't. Um, yeah, Sally the seal. I mean, because Sammy's been done, haven't yeah. it? So there we go. Sally the seal. I think we've done it. I know. I hope this seal survives. I hope that's a good omen for it. Right.